You know, when we're charging a lipo, lipo pack, we simply charge it just like one by one, like this, yeah? So you stick it in the charger, you put it in the lipo main connector, and you choose your battery, and yeah, you fire it away, and you start charging it. But this way, when you charge single battery one by one, it takes, let's say, half an hour to charge this battery, this way we have to wait for this to charge once this one is charged we can grab another battery then we, we put it on and then charge it again so two batteries are roughly taking an hour to charge but there is a thing called parallel charging which can cut your time in half if you have two batteries it will cut the time in half if you have four batteries it will cut the time in one fourth because one battery will take th say roughly 30 minutes say 30 minutes and then four batteries are going to take two hours but then in 30 minutes you can charge all four of them but with the parallel charges there are there are a couple of things you should be aware of you can charge only same type of batteries so this is 1800 milliamp um, capacity. This one has 1550. So I'll be I'll be charging these two together always, and these two together. The other thing to keep it in mind is that you always before you put them on charging, you always check the battery per cell voltage. This one is 3.71. 3.72 so roughly say 3.71 and if I check this one now this one is come on 3.7 so these two batteries can go together we can charge them together their voltage is very very like little difference 3.7 and this one has 3.7 we have to keep in mind that the cell voltage should be pretty similar like you know really close so the next question comes how can we charge them parallel like how can we just connect such a way so they can charge with this charger which supports only one battery at a time and then we can charge two batteries or three or four or five or six whatever whatever your charger can take this can take six amps so I can charge if it's 1800, 1800. So if I'm charging at 1C, this becomes 1.8 plus 1.8. That becomes, what, 3.6. So this is 3.6 amp worth of load, okay? This one becomes 1 1.5 plus 1 1.5 around 3, 3 amps. Now this charger can take 6 amp. So this is 3 amp, I can put 4 of them, it becomes 6 amps. This charger can easily support these 4 batteries on a parallel charging board. So parallel charging board, we can buy them online fairly cheap. But it's a really easy circuit, so we can create it ourselves. I got one right here. Um, I just built it. So. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can make this parallel charger for yourself and then, yeah, take advantage of charging your battery parallel and take less time charging, more time flying. And this one can come close.